right a little bit. There's the hill fort again. That you can see some diggers and stuff going on. I went into the wood. Well, I've been in from both ends. And the other day, I came out from this end and came joined the strawberry line to get to Winscombe to get my bus. But uh, on on top of that flat hill, there's a big carboniferous plateau, which is the ancient Iron Age hill fort. There's a lot of history, a lot of excavation work has discovered things about that fort. Now privately owned and being parceled off and sold. So people can put sheds on it. I want to get some pictures from this angle anyway. Basically, this is a strawberry line. I've just stopped off at... Uh, Thatcher's where they make all the cider but I uh, thought I'd do a little video to add to my Bamwell stuff it's busier now than it always is this side of course the cemetery's up here where, where there's a bridle path where you can walk right by it I'm going to stop and take some pictures. Over there's the digger where that smoke is. That wasn't working on Monday. He wasn't working. Got a small digger actually in it today. Looks small. So there's the wood. Gonna take some pictures over and out. Right, it's a continuation of the video I was doing a minute ago. It's quite a good view of the hill fort from here, look. Like a big cone, isn't it? Flat on the top. A flat plain, and you've got the Hinkley Point scheme going along right through the valley there. You've got, um, I don't know what the, if that's the farmer doing that tidying up over there, could be. But there's a nice, lovely view of the hill fort, which I've now explored to a certain extent. You can't see the hill at the very top from here. Um, there's some very good aerial photographs that have been done of it though. Right, so I'm out on my bike. I'm going to stop for a drink of water now. There's the strawberry line. Once busy steam trains huffed and puffed along there with the strawberries. I'll be over there later cycling that way so I can get views of the hill fort from over there. Winscombe. Winscombe and Crooks Peak area. Then I'll come back over by Christon. That's plan A. <sighs> and there's supposed to be a bypass going on as well. I don't know where that's going. Why don't they have it where this is? They've dug off of it up. They just will have the bypass there. Maybe that's the plan. Over and out. Quick video. Um, the lane I wanted to go down over towards, um, over that way, as if I was going to go to Christon, where I'd be following a, a lane at the base of Banwell Hill and Wood, where the tower is. Go along, you've got the waterworks. Banwell Castle. Banwell Hill Fort and Wood there. This is from over here. Further over there we've got the 
road barrel quarry which I'm going to try and get up soon because I want to get a view of the hill fort from up there because that will give me the best view from above I think so that's plan A I can hear all the workmen down there. Yeah, we haven't been able to cross over to get onto the lower track down there. So, um, a lower path which should take us over the motorway bridge and then over to there and Christon and... So I don't really know. I'll probably have to go to Loxton and it'll be a different view. But like I said, the next plan is Rowborough again and up through the fort, um, up through the quarry. Because when I'm up there, I should, get, should be able to get the best view of that hill fort. So this is Sheila. There is a way across here apparently. But you can't take your bike. <laughs> yeah, they're really busy. Really busy. Over and out for a minute. Another super, super duper view everyone. That's a plantation and all that over there. There's Christon and Christon Church. That wood there is the one I want you to go up today, but the road's blocked off because of the Hinkley Point scheme. Now, if I could have got across the fields, say I was walking, I could have gone across the fields and got over into a gate over there and then crossed the bridge. But I can't do it on my bike. They shut all the little lanes off down there to the public for the now, for now. I bet they probably would have let me by. Because it did say access only. Right over there we got the, uh, right in the distance there, we've got um, the quarry, Dalbury Quarry at Sanford, um, not Dalbury, um, Sanford Quarry, which will give me brilliant views of that hill there, which is Banwell Hill Fort. Here's Banwell Hill and Woods. This looks much more like a hill fort to me, this one, than that one. They're probably all one big hill fort, I should imagine, really. Big, like, um, Whirlbury Hill Fort is big as those two put together, if you include the golf course and everything. So I've got some brilliant views today. It's just a pity the, uh, and I've been all around there. I know all this. I walked up the bridle path lane up through there loads of times now. But there's the motorway, you see. Um, and the only way I could have got there is to get across these fields to the lane where that house is there. There's a house there. And uh, gone over the bridge. I could have gone, then gone over the bridge, you see. But never mind, we're going to have to do Loxton and Bleeding instead today. Which um, is a bit dark, but it's very steep and very narrow and very bendy at the top. And that means it's very dangerous. And that's why I don't like doing it. I never walk it if I can help it. And, well, I'll have to push my bike up it uh, uh, near the top. I won't be able to cycle up it at all. But anyway, hopefully we'll get them in one piece and have some dinner. Over and out. Motorway's back to normal now. Everything was very quiet during the extreme COVID period, which could come back because Everybody knows there's going to be a second wave. It's already starting to creep up. And probably most people have actually got it now. It comes into a lot of the videos, I'm afraid, because it's, um, in a, world, it's, a, it's a world event. It's a world event. Over and out.